Hi, this is Owen from All About Braces, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about why do we ask patients to wear elastics. When we say elastics, we mean these rubber bands that go on the braces sometimes, um, that we ask patients to attach to their braces as you see they are here. And the answer to the question is that if you think about simple physics, the individual braces on the individual teeth do a great job of moving the teeth up, down, left, right. We can rotate teeth, we can pull them in, out. But what we have trouble doing with an individual brace is it's difficult to get an entire movement more of a jaw. If somebody has an open bite, for instance, where their teeth are touching in the back but not the front, or their bite is shifted, or they have an underbite, uh, much like would be something like this of an underbite or an overbite, right, where the teeth are over. And to get those movements, we need some element, some way to create a force to move the jaw in a way that creates a better bite or, in technical terms, a better occlusion uh, of the teeth to bring them together. And the way that we get that force, believe it or not, are these little rubber bands. I know a lot of patients think, oh, come on, a little rubber band isn't going to move my jaw. And yet the truth is, not only are these rubber bands very effective if worn regularly, but they actually work reasonably fast in the terms of orthodontics. So in a matter of a few months, we can get significant jaw movement. However, it does require significant patient compliance, meaning the patient is empowered as to whether or not they are wearing those rubber bands on the braces. The patient can take them off, the patient can put them on. For this to work effectively, we need our patients to wear those rubber bands as much as absolutely possible. Even 24 hours a day, if possible, we do have patients who will uh, actually eat and have meals with those rubber bands on, depending what rubber bands we ask them to wear. But even if they have to take them off for meals, we do ask that our patients wear those rubber bands and every other time of the day, including sleep, to try to continue to apply that force that we need to move the jaw and give our patients a perfect bite. So while some patients uh, note that putting on the rubber bands while not painful, some patients find it annoying, other patients find that it's not a problem at all, the truth is whether it's a patient who enjoys wearing them or not, we do need those patients to wear them for us to give them the great smile that we know we can give them. So hopefully if you're a patient in braces right now and your orthodontist, whether that's us or another orthodontist, has asked you to wear rubber bands, you now understand why your orthodontist is asking you to wear those rubber bands, how important it is for your treatment to wear those rubber bands, and hopefully as part of this video, if I've succeeded, you now understand that you should wear those rubber bands and that you will wear those rubber bands. Thanks for listening. We'll come back with more tips uh, at a later date.